own a home or have plans to in the future, or are you upside down in your mortgage and need help? Tune in right now to the Call Tony Real Estate Radio Show with Tony Patillo and her co-host Carla Dennis. This is where you come to learn about buying real estate. Here's Tony. Hello, Los Angelinos. I'm your host, Tony Patillo here, and you are listening to Call Tony Real Estate Radio here on KTLK AM 1150. I'm here with my co-host, Carla Dennis. We're really excited to have with us today Lori Murphy. She's an attorney at Valencia Rose, and with civil engineering degrees and more than 20 years of law practice, Lori's unique skills in real estate and construction litigation matters set her apart from most attorneys in several of her practice areas. Her clients include high-end residential and commercial property owners, including corporate partnerships and individual property owners, contractors and developers, and other real estate professionals, as well as business owners. As a member of the firm for over 20 years and the head of its litigation practice group for over 10 years, Ms. Murphy manages and mentors experience an experienced group of litigators that are noted for their ability to efficiently solve their clients' complex disputes. So I want to welcome you to the show, Lori. Thank you so much for being here with us. Thanks, Tony. It's, it's a real pleasure to be here today. Now, we live in California. Real estate is very pricey in California. Yeah. And think about this. If you were buying or one of your clients was buying a business and mm-hmm. spending millions of dollars on a business, mm-hmm. would you close it without having a lawyer look over the deal? No way. I don't think so. No. So I think it's a mistake yeah. and a pitfall for a purchaser or sometimes a seller to rely solely upon their broker right. or their agent. Right. Real estate transactions, even a residential one where the money may not be great, they can be incredibly complex. Absolutely. And you can have somebody having to sign like two inches of documents. Mm -hmm. And because of the complexity and the dollars involved, in a lot of cases, I think people are better served if they have a lawyer look over the deal. Absolutely. Now, I'm not here to bash real estate um, professionals. I think they're, you know, most of them are terrific and they're ethical, et cetera. But they do hold a lot of power in a transaction. Mm -hmm. And they're the ones that get paid, but they don't get paid till you close. Right. I, I let them know I cannot advise them from a legal perspective, and I highly encourage them to get an attorney to review these documents. I think yeah. that's wise. I yeah. think that's wise yeah. because, you know, um, brokers and agents, man, they can get the property listed. They can get mm-hmm. lots of buyers in there. Right. But, again, mm-hmm. a transaction, a real estate transaction is sort of fraught with... Um, with problems. Absolutely. And a lot of them close with, mm-hmm. without any problem, but a lot of them go. Can end up saving a lot of money in the long run if you mediate before everything gets blown out of proportion. Mm-hmm. And binding arbitration is where the parties agree either before a dispute arises or after a dispute arises. There's a process called discovery where each side is required, if asked, to disclose information documents, answer questions, give depositions, et cetera, et cetera. Again, we want to remind you that we're here every Saturday, every Saturday at 3 p.m. on Call Tony Real Estate Radio, KTLK AM 1150, where we are committed to bringing you tools for positive change. If you tuned in late and you'd like to go back and listen to the full show, please go to calltony.com. That's calltony with an I dot com. And click on the prior shows link. You can always reach out to our off-air number at 888-309-9797. That's 888-309-9797. We want to thank you for tuning in. Don't forget to follow us.